four years strong dropped their new album analysis paralysis which is quite the title is um, it fun it's so fun yeah and this is this is quite the record dude okay so first listen of this record I was hooked immediately. I mean, from the singles, I think we were both kind of already on board. Um, I think maybe there was one single. I think, didn't they drop like four? Four or five, yeah. yeah. Four or five, yeah. I think only out of the four or five, there was only one that each of us kind of went, mm, I don't know about this one so much, but the rest are fucking incredible. <laughs> in the context of the record, there are no bad tracks, in my opinion. I don't have a single track where I went, mm, this one overstates welcome. This one just doesn't sound good or doesn't fit or anything fucking head to toe top to bottom start to finish incredible record um maybe it's me is my personal favorite um i also fucking love roller coaster and then bad habits incredible i get the who now i get the appeal of the who i was i was waiting for it again and again and again and also the opener um was my favorite single that they dropped so that one will also be named in in my favorites it's such a fucking solid record it's just so nostalgic but also fresh it's just it checks all the boxes for me man it's so fucking catchy too mm. yeah yeah that's that's you know that's the that's always been the thing before four years strong is like how how catchy the hooks on all mm -hmm. of the songs are um, it, do, it don't matter if it's a single or the deepest of deep cuts every mm -hmm. single song ha is catchy um what I like about the record is how it it almost seamlessly like will go from being super heavy to mm -hmm. like no screaming, no breakdowns, no nothing. Just chilling. And yeah. it doesn't like you don't even really notice it because the record is flowing so seamlessly and they do yeah. it throughout the album. Um where you know it just it just it it creates this fucking amazing experience where like if you are here for the heavy stuff there's mm -hmm. plenty of that on the record. If Plenty. you if you like when four years strong is not heavy, which they're great, but mm -hmm. uh, riffs, bro. They've got they've Love got the they've got the they've got the songs that are a little less riffy. They've got mm -hmm. a slow song at the very end. It's really um, the perfect blend for everybody. Um, mm -hmm. But it, it's 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 the perfect blend just in general. I really I really enjoyed it. It's fucking fun. It's catchy. Um, yep. And it's it's incredibly solid, like you said. Like on first listen, I was like, "Easy, easy album of the year contender." Exactly, it's on my top ten yeah. already, man. Yeah. Easy, easy top ten uh, contender for me, um, cause it's just like I'm just I, I'm like at a loss for words. Like it's hard to formulate my opinion mm -hmm. on the record not because i'm confused on it but mm -hmm. because i am so blown away by it that i'm yeah. like now how do i put my thoughts of holy fuck this is incredible mm -hmm. into words yeah. that aren't just that exactly because we have to put a little bit of effort into this <laughs> but it's like genuinely it is such a solid full piece of work mm -hmm. it is fucking incredible i think you nailed it where you said it's it's balanced and seamless because you're right it does have moments where it's just like oh shit i look up and i'm like oh they haven't screamed in a while there hasn't been a little breakdown in a while where are the riffs but it's like i'm okay with it because then the moment i realize that that's gone it's like we're right back up again so it's i i really enjoy this 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 year has been so good for music i already have my top 11 for <laughs> album of the years and it's kind of pissing me off because the fall releases haven't even come out yet man yeah. <laughs> i'm cooked i'm done dude you're so cooked um and what what's even crazier is like like you said like you'll look up and all of a sudden mm -hmm. they're like back to heavy and you just realize that they hadn't screamed in a second like yeah. i didn't even fucking notice on my first listen like that's how no i'm just yeah. like i was just so blown away and engrossed by the record that i just mm -hmm. came out of it and i was like okay now i have to listen to that again exactly yeah and, I, mm. and, and that's the feeling i keep having with this record because mm -hmm. I, I you know as much as i wanted to do nothing but listen to this album over the weekend Damn. i had a, a show and then a podcast to get ready for so this has unfortunately been on the back burner but the train into new york city today hey Ooh, man <laughs> this album doesn't stand a damn chance yeah. man <laughs> holy shit i'm so excited yeah. i don't know I hope well they are going on tour, correct? Yes, they sir. Are. They are going on a headliner 
this late fall, early mm-hmm. winter. Um, mm-hmm. Got support from Free Throw, One Step Closer, and Death Lenses. So uh, if that's solid fucking tour. yeah, if that's hitting a city near you, you should go. Um, a couple of my favorites are Aftermath, Afterthought, because um, that song oh, keeps playing in my head. Um, it's like I've listened to that song a billion times because it just keeps playing in mm-hmm. my in the little radio up upstairs. Um, a bad habit. <laughs> That's Ooh. why. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's it. Um, and I like Paranoia. Um, mm-hmm. I think that it's a, it's a solid track. It's fun and it's super catchy. It's it's mm-hmm. heavy, but it's got like s- like super poppy elements. I feel. Yeah. Um, so I think that that song is very cool as well. But I like the entire record. I could sit here and name every single one, um, yeah, and and why I like it. But overall, I think it's an incredibly solid record. I'm so glad. You know, I was I was patiently waiting. You know, it's been a while. Uh, mm-hmm. Brain Pain came out in 2020, and you know they they put out a deluxe of Brain Pain, and then they put okay. out a re-recording of uh, one of their other records in the in the pro in the in the time between these two albums so it's not like we haven't heard from four year um yeah. but you know it's been a while since we've gotten new music so i've been patiently waiting uh mm-hmm. but you know this this record made that four years of like basically no new music well worth the wait hey i guess you could say that they came out of the four years s- strong girl i don't know i tried you know, hey man. man listen don't quit we your day th- job <laughs> <laughs> What's your, what's your background in music, Shane? 